Hi guys, welcome to the May edition of Kids Gazette Cooking Series. We are so excited to be back in the kitchen making food craving memories with you. I am Chelsea Greider, I am the events planner with the Gazette. I am so excited to be back in the kitchen. We are gonna thank our sponsors, Hills Bank and Iowa Pork Producers for getting behind this program and being able to be in the kitchen. We wanna thank our location partner, Plum Supply, for letting us to come into their kitchens and cook here this day. We also wanna thank our videographer partner, TKM Productions. Guys, May is Entrepreneurial Month. We are celebrating entrepreneurs. We are also gonna be making lemon dream bars. Yes, lemon dream bars. They are so good. We want to welcome our guests, the Mulane family. We're gonna welcome Riley, Melissa, and their two kids, Isla and Asher. Come on into the kitchen, team. Come on in, take a step up. Are you guys excited? Yeah. yeah. I love it, guys. Well, Riley is an entrepreneur. We are so excited to have an entrepreneur in the kitchen, be able to talk one-on-one. -on -one. And I'm so excited to have Melissa here with us to be have the other side of living with an entrepreneur, <laughs> right? Well, guys, we're gonna get them prepped and ready to go. We will be right back. Here's a quick message from our sponsor, Hills Bank. At Hills Bank, we value teaching kids the importance of saving for their future. All right guys, well welcome back to the kitchen. We are making lemon dream bars and we are celebrating entrepreneurial month. All right guys, you guys wanna walk through the different ingredients we have? Yeah. yeah. Okay. All right, so in front of Asher, you're gonna be able to see the lemon cake mix. So this is lemon cake mix, guys, you can buy from the grocery store. We have a half a cup of butter, which is actually a full stick of butter, unsalted, and it is softened at room temperature. You are also gonna be able to see lemon zest from a full lemon. We also have a half a cup of white chocolate chips. Who does not love chocolate, right, guys? Mm. <laughs> Asher doesn't like chocolate. Yeah. No! Uh. <laughs> we have a third a cup. <laughs> mm. I love it. We, guys, we have a third a cup of lemon curd. Again, same thing. You can make your homemade, but again, for this, guys, we actually just bought it from the store, which is fantastic. And we also have one large egg. And we have the final touch, a quarter cup of sweetened and condensed milk. You guys ready to start mixing? Yeah. Awesome. Magic ingredient. I love it. So guys, as you're seeing it come across your screen right now, you're gonna be seeing the digital recipe card and your shopping list. Make sure to print those off, add those to your recipe book. Make sure to take that with you. Those are gonna be a fantastic add-on to your recipe book. All right, guys, let's start making the ingredients. Ready? Yeah. All right. So we are going to line our nine by nine pan with parchment paper. We do have parchment paper. You're gonna wanna leave a little bit of overhang guys on this so we can pull the bars out and set aside um, so that we can cut them. And that actually has a perforated end on it. So you can rip it right off like dad did. Fantastic, it looks good. I never tried lemon bar. Oh, you. Yes, you have. <laughs> I love it. All right, guys. Well, you, uh, Isla, if you wanna set that to the side, hun, and we'll wait for that to get started. Sound good? Now we're gonna start creating the base mixture of our lemon dream bars. All right, Asher, do you wanna undo the butter and get the wrapper oh off? Sure. Sold. <laughs> this is the best they've listened in probably a year, to be honest with you. Fantastic. So guys, you want this to soften at room temperature. You do not want to uh, soften this in the microwave. It will melt and we do not want it to melt. There you go. You gotta unfold this part. It's kind of like unwrapping a present, right? Ooh. Unwrapping a go. butter present. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Yeah, All right, now we're gonna have dad, we're gonna have dad and mom help us. Okay. We're gonna fluff the butter with our electric hand mixer. Guys, make sure that you have parental supervision with this as you're using the electric mixer. All right, we're gonna get it smooth and we're gonna get it fluffy. There we go, looking good. Thank you. So much 
support. I love it. We got a good support system, don't we? Yes. Oh, are you getting another chocolate chip? Yeah. I'll be I surprised if there's seven of those left by the time this is all said and done. Mm -hmm. So we are done now with our electric mixer, guys. We are actually gonna start moving in our lemon cake mix. So now we're gonna take one large egg. Large egg, buddy, right here. My turn. I love mixing. Trying to not get too many shells. So see. Yep. Do you wanna pour? Do you wanna pour into here so you can just make okay, sure you don't get any shells? Oh, 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 I got it. Hey, no shell. Let's go. We're gonna pour in the lemon zest next. Yeah. You might need to use your spatula, Tap honey. It to, like that, honey. There you go. Tap the bottom. Perfect. Now we're gonna let mom use the electric mixer, and we're gonna let her mix this all up to make our base mixture. Woohoo! You guys are doing great. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah, but but who's gonna who's gonna who's gonna who's gonna taste the lemon dream bars? Okay, Riley. So you have to tell me, being an entrepreneur, how did you get started? I got started DJing uh, weddings about 16 years ago. I've always loved music. I grew up uh, with parents that love music, my dad specifically, who uh, has been in bands for like 40 years. So growing up, he was always quizzing me on songs when we were driving in the truck to, you know, different destinations. You know, when Eric Clapton would come on, he would say, you know, name the bands Eric Clapton would have, you know, been in and all that stuff. So it was very much a trivia based car ride with him most of the time. And so I took that and um, when I shortly after graduating high school, I linked up with uh, with Travis Newell with Unique Events, who's still a good friend of mine, and um, started hitting the ground running on the DJing side of things. Got into weddings and just, you know, quickly realized there was a major opportunity to create more positive guest experiences and client experiences, and uh, just kind of evolved from there. And now doing doing all sorts of stuff. So when, when you figure out like what I do all day, you let me know because I don't I don't know. It's just it's all over the place. But yeah. I feel like this is the life of the <laughs> never, the day is never the same, right? Yeah, it's yeah. Awesome. It's, a, it's a very exciting journey, that's for sure. So. What is your one number one tip from starting from scratch for an entrepreneur? To, to refine your passion and go hard. Just go hard. Figure out what it is that keeps you up at night, what you're thinking about all day, you know, and then start to bring people into your corner, into your circle that not only support you, but can become very strategic in making sure that, you know, they're providing you tools and resources to turn that passion into a profession, you know. So that's, you know, a lot of what we talk about, even with these maniacs, these, you know, six-year-olds figuring out, you know, what they're into, you yeah. know, and trying to shine a light on those things and be able to, uh, to flex that interest and seeing where it goes, you know. Yeah, that's awesome. so, yeah. Well, Melissa right now is creating that base mixture. Guys, with us making this cake, it takes just a little bit to get it all crushed up and get, make a really, really firm dough. She is doing a fantastic job. I think we're almost there. Yeah, it looks great. She, she's yeah. the baker of the family, that's yes, for sure. That you is don't, awesome. You don't want me baking anything. I'm a baker sure. too. You're a good baker oh, with mom. And then, and then afterward, and then afterward, you guys do the Yep. You guys are doing great. There we go. Now Isla and Asher, who's the first taste tester between you two and mom? I would say probably me. <laughs> <laughs> There's no probably I'm about me. it. He is. Me. I me. love it. Me. Are you too, you Isla? Yeah. You're the she first just, one to she, taste she likes to be after we've I love it. We had a garage sale one time and you guys were serving out some lemonade, weren't you? Yeah. Some money. And you were making some money, yeah, that's yeah. always a good thing. I love it. Well guys, Hills Make is all about supporting entrepreneurs. They love to help kids start their own business with their annual and popular, popular Lemon Boss program. To learn more and help a child become a Lemon Boss, visit hillsbank.com slash lemon dash boss. All right, guys, well, Melissa's got the base mixer ready to go. We're gonna take about two thirds of that mixture and we're gonna put it into our nine by nine lined parchment paper pan. Isla, you wanna help dad? Okay. <laughs> As Asher is snacking on the chocolate chips right now. Scoop it up in there and then I'll slide it out. 
Yep, we're gonna do about two thirds of it. So just leave just a little bit out, okay? There we go. Yeah. When in yeah. doubt, use your hands is what yeah. I say. I'm losing my hands. I know. Use your hands, babe. After this, after we're doing it, or after we're done with our cooking show, we're leaving. Where are you going? Where, are you going on a trip? Yeah. Where are you going? We're going to Florida and um, oh, with our friends, the Peterson's. The <laughs> like the Malay. All right, Melissa, how is it living with an entrepreneur every single day? It's great, like <laughs> most of the time. <laughs> uh, the long hours and nights and weekends can get a little challenging, but you know, his career has really given us a blessed life and um, having the flexibility to make it to all the kids' activities and me getting to stay home and homeschool them and you know, getting to pick up and kind of travel whenever he does have some downtime. It's really been a, it really has been a blessing for our family. And yeah, um, not to say it doesn't come with its challenges. Yeah. Uh, because I do feel like he's obviously gone more than he's home most of the time. But that comes with the territory. It does. So I would say overall it's been fantastic and that's awesome. Yeah. 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 Kind of find your balance, right? You kind of find that balance of like, Right, being able to have that family dynamic, but also you get to do what you love, which is fantastic. So that's, that is so cool, guys. Yes. Well, we're so excited to have you guys in the kitchen and being able to celebrate Entrepreneurial Month. Well, so thank we're you so for excited. having us, yes. we appreciate it. Guys, let's start layering your lemon dream bars. So next thing we're gonna do, guys, is we're gonna take the lemon curd and we're gonna spread it on top of the base mixture. So just make sure guys, you don't wanna get it all the way to the edges. You kinda of wanna leave it in like just a little bit of a square, kinda of like painting a picture. Well, Asher, do you wanna take the white chocolate chips and do you want to start sprinkling them on top? All right, so sprinkle them on top, guys. Keep spreading them out. Good job. Now, do you want to take the sweetened and condensed milk and maybe have dad or mom do this and we're gonna just drizzle it over top of okay, that. Let's hold it together because we'll just drizzle it. Nice, kind of zigzag, okay? Go. This is a fantastic recipe for summer, guys. Don't forget, grilling season is upon us, so make sure as the weather gets warmer, check out Iowa Pork Producers for some awesome pork grilling recipes. Perfect. All right, so next we're gonna take the little bit of base mixture that we have left, and we're gonna take it and we're gonna crumble it on top. Yep, little pieces just like that. Perfect, guys. All right, and then do you guys want to take your hands and you're just going to press it down, just take those crumbles and press them down just a little bit so it seals all together. There you go, good job guys. All right guys, well I think it's time to get these bad boys in the oven. Are you guys ready to get them in the oven? Yeah. Yeah, oh great. Do you want to walk over with dad and mom and we'll get them in the oven? Perfect. You guys are gonna want your oven preheated, guys, at 350 degrees. Isla's gonna open it up, or Dad's, yeah? There you go. It's gonna be hot when you open it, so be careful. There, there you go. go, good job. It's hot! Yeah, good it's job. It's like summer. Yeah, like summer, good job. We're gonna put these in, guys, and we're gonna let them bake for between 29 to 32 minutes until they're just slightly brown on top. You're gonna wanna make sure to let these bars cool completely before you cut into them. Guys, as we're getting these in the oven right now, we're gonna check out a quick word from our sponsor, Iowa Pork Producers. We want to leave a legacy. We wanna leave our environment every bit as good as it was when we were handed the opportunity to farm this ground. We want to leave this place better, not only for the people we are, and the people in our family, but we want to leave this land better. My name is Lisa Rasmussen and I'm an Iowa pig farmer. We care about Iowa too. 
Well guys, welcome back. We're gonna pull out our lemon dream bars as we are celebrating entrepreneurial month. All right guys, well I think we're ready to try. I think the kids are ready to try them as well. I think now we can start eating them. Okay. All right, they look so good. I just can't wait. Okay. Perfect. Now, okay. Now, now hold on. Cheers. 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 Mm -hmm. Turn out good. Mm -hmm. Yummy. Those are awesome, guys. Mm -hmm. Well, Riley, Melissa, Asher, and Isla, thank you guys so much for coming in. Thank we you. want to thank you guys again. We had so much fun. Kids, you guys have fun? Yeah! I love yeah. it! I really, I really wish I can, I really wish I didn't go on vacation, go come back to you again. And yeah. Make some more. Riley, any last words of wisdom for anybody that's wanting to be an entrepreneur? Yeah, you know, for me, I've just tried to simplify it. Follow that passion, surround yourself with some really great people. I'm fortunate to be surrounded by some incredible individuals with our team at Ann and Ellis, where we help clients plan weddings, help them figure out their budget, their venue situation, decor, floral. So check out annandellis.com, little shameless plug there, but uh, surround yourself with great people, positive people, have an incredible support system like I do here, and all will be good. Well, guys, make sure to check out Kids Gazette Digital and online and in print. There's so many great activities from all ages throughout. We wanna thank our sponsors again, Iowa Pork Producers and Hills Bay for getting behind this program. We also wanna thank our location partner, Plum Supply, and our videographer partner, TKM Productions. We cannot do this without them. Guys, in June, we're gonna be making cheesy Italian grinder dip. It is so good. Make sure to come back in June, check that out. Again, be making food craving memories. <laughs>